I'm Dr. Jenny Cruz and I'm the program director and founder of Music Mentors. When I first came to Central State University, I had attended two schools previous that um, had wonderful preparatory programs that are very similar to Music Mentors. In fact, Music Mentors is based on those two models. We had the resources financially, the federal funding. We had the students who I knew would be great mentors, teachers, and I knew that there was a need in the community. I mean, you see, arts are always the first programs that get slashed from an educational budget. I knew we could, we could fill that gap. We could be that, that community provider that could give music back to the community. A lot of people don't get this opportunity, and I was blessed to be a part of this program from the beginning and I have seen so many students and it always brings a joy to me to know that I had an impact on that child's life. This is somebody I can call my student, my student with joy. You can tell who really wants it very badly because when students, when they say, I want to learn this and then they start showing up, I say, I would do anything and everything to make sure that you get there because other students I say, I'm like, whether if I'm on hours, if I'm on the clock, off the clock, I'm gonna be here for you. Why? Because you want to be here. We have such a diverse uh, population of students in the Music Mentors Program. To see the littlest one who's five, and the next one who's seven, nine, 12, 15, and then the dad get up, that's like, I'm like making bands right now. I'm, I'm forming the next generation of, of, you know, rock bands. So it's really neat to see that kind of thing. The whole atmosphere of being involved in, in music uh, was very exciting for me. And I, I uh, remember how disappointing it was when my parents weren't quite so interested in the things that I was interested in. So it's really exciting to know that they enjoy the music and I can be excited for them and they can see that in me. Dr. Cruz is just an excellent professor and we heard about the program and the wonderful benefits that it gives to the students that participate in the program. Also it gave us a chance to give our kids a sense of arts and the music which I think we're losing in the community. If a parent is interested in enrolling their child um, in, into the program, the first thing they do is go to our website, centralstate.edu. They go into the search box at the top of the page in the center and type in Music Mentors. They'll find a link for the information and application page, and then they click on the registration application and fill out their information. They'll receive an email confirming that we received the application, and then I'll send them a personal email telling them about the program, if they've been accepted, or if they've been put on the wait list. Currently, we have about 90 plus participants taking private lessons, and then the ones that we've added, I'd say in four years, Gosh, I wouldn't know how to actually quantify it. Anywhere between 150 to 200. Our federal funding will end at the end of 2012. And it is my passion in life. This program I feel very um, connected to because I really believe in it and I really want to see it thrive beyond its funding right now. So at the end of 2012, we will no longer have the federal funding we've had. And I'm committed to continuing the program. If members of the community wanted to be an angel and sponsor this program, be any kind of a donor in a financial aspect, in any way that they could find to make this program continue, I know that myself, I would be extremely, extremely thankful. But more importantly, I know the kids of the program and my music mentors, they would, they would be thankful as well. This program is important because it really brings out the talent that we have in the community. It brings out the talent that we have in the university, which I believe that a lot of people don't understand. That as so many cutbacks are going in school, especially in the arts programs, that they have to find programs such as this and they have to invest in their children so that they have well-rounded young people. And then especially when the time for the, uh, for the performance, when they're up there, I'm like, yes, yes, I, we worked very hard, it's time to have fun, let's do this. And then when they finish and they smile and you can feel the warmth all in the room, you can see the family smiling, it feels very rewarding. I would say that I really wish I could do more than just because each time I see that, I'm ready for the next round to go 10 times better than I've done before. I mean, my job is so gratifying for so many reasons. But when I get the email that says, Dr. Cruz, thank you so much. My daughter is so much more confident now. Her grades are getting better because she knew she could make it on stage and if she could do it in such a high pressure environment, she could do it anywhere. 
So to hear that or to hear, you know, my son can finally concentrate in math class now. And I think it's just because his teacher kept teaching him how to focus in a lesson or how to push away all the distractions in, in a recital and learn how to find that space where he could do what he needed to do. Thank you. That sometimes makes my semester to know that you're touching someone, touching a family on that deep of a level. That's really exciting.